Hi everybody, it's Mina. Welcome back to my channel, or if this is the very first video that you're seeing of me, then welcome to my channel. Please be sure to hit the subscribe button down below if you didn't already. I post every day except for Tuesday and Friday afternoon sometimes. And today in this video, I'm going to do a top 10 things to do when you're sick. And I don't know if you guys could tell, but I'm sick right now. Sadly, I tested positive for COVID. And... Sorry, and I thought I'd cheer myself up by doing a top 10 things to do when you are sick. Now being sick really sucks, but there are many things you can do to keep yourself busy when you're sick. Like you can get a lot of house projects done. You can do this, you can do that. Do that. You can do so many things when you're sick. So the only thing you can't do is go out with your friends or go to work or go to school. Cool, but there are things you could do at home to keep yourself busy to pass the time. So I'm going to get started and these are mostly things that I like to do when I'm sick. If you guys, are, guys get sick, what are things you do to keep yourself busy? Let me know. So I'm going to get started. So number one in my list happy knit. So a lot of you guys know I love to knit, especially when I'm sick. I find it keeps me busy, it relaxes me, and it calms me for when I'm anxious and I can't go anywhere. And it helps me pass the time when I'm knitting because it's just a great relaxing thing for me despite the fact um, it calms my anxiety. I get to make so many great things like blankets, hats, scarves, so many different things. Number two on my list would have to be reading a book. So reading a book is a great way for me to stay busy because I love looking at picture books. I think they're very fun, relaxing. And reading also is just a great thing to pass the time. My mom likes to read a lot, especially when she's sick. And I find that reading books usually keeps me busy as well. Number three in my list have to make YouTube videos. I know some people may not want to make YouTube videos when they're sick, but I definitely don't mind making YouTube videos when I'm sick just because I've seen so many people who have been sick with colds, coughs, or... So I see a lot of people who are sick make YouTube videos like some people are sick with like cold some people might be sick with stuffy noses there are so many people on YouTube who still make YouTube videos even though they're sick because they find it just keeps them busy and it's just a great way um, to help pass the time for when you're sick at home and you don't feel well. And that's a good thing to keep yourself busy with, with YouTube videos. I see, like I've said, I've seen so many people who are very sick film YouTube videos all the time, especially if their noses are stuffy or if they have sore throats or something, but they still make YouTube videos. You, know, so you don't have to make a YouTube video when you're sick if you don't want to, but I think it's just a great way to help pass the time. Number four on my list has to be watch movies. Now, this is what I do all the time when I'm sick is that I watch movies. I find watching movies is a great way for me to stay calm. It helps me relax. It helps me ease my mind. And it's just really a um, good thing to do. I've been watching movies ever since I was a little kid. Kid, whenever I was sick. Like, when I was going through chemo, I watched tons of movies because we would bring so many movies to the hospital. Because... I found that the movies were just a great distraction for me and they helped pass the time in my stays of the hospital. Number five on my list has to be make a top 10 video list for YouTube. So this is what I like to do whenever I'm sick is make a bunch of top 10 videos. Top 10 video list because I find when I do that it just helps me stay busy. It just gives me something to do because when you are sick you can't really leave the house or go anywhere, you can't go to the store, you can't do this, you can't do that. So you gotta like, like um, stay in your house, especially if you've been tested positive for COVID. COVID. So basically what you can do is you can just make lists of YouTube video ideas, like top 10 lists. Number six on my list would have to be draw. So drawing is a great way to keep yourself busy when you're sick because um, you get to draw so many things, like your favorite characters, characters you made up, or just anything in general, which is really cool. Number seven on my list has to be watch YouTube videos. So watching YouTube videos is a great way to stay busy because you get to watch 
So many upcoming movie trailers, you get to watch like fun DIY videos, your favorite cartoons, tunes, and just like uh, just a bunch of stuff in general, just whatever you want to watch on YouTube. Tube. So watching YouTube is a great way to distract yourself for when you're sick. Number eight on my list has to be hang out with your dog. So I definitely hang out with my dogs whenever I'm sick, especially Bean, because I find Bean is a wonderful distraction for me. Mr. Pickles is a great distraction too. But hanging out with your dog is a great thing because they can keep you company, they'll make you feel better, and they can just cheer you up in general if you're feeling down in the dumps because you're sick. I know my dogs definitely do. Number nine on my list has to be crochet. So crocheting is a great way to pass the time when you're sick because it keeps you busy and if you're sitting at home and you're not doing anything, crocheting, and if you like to crochet, crochet you definitely should do crocheting. It's just a great way for you to stay busy. It relaxes you, it calms your mind, and it's super fun in general. Number 10 on my list has to be do crossword puzzles. So doing crossword puzzles is a great way to stay busy because they're great brain teasers. Crossword puzzles are so much fun. I definitely love crossword puzzles. They are quite difficult, but I think they're still fun in general. And I definitely think you guys should do them whenever you're sick just because they'll pass the time of your quarantine if you've been tested positive for COVID or if you're just sick in general with a cold. Okay, okay, those are my top 10 things to do with your do when you're sick. I um, hope you guys enjoyed the video. Thank you so much for watching. Please be sure to like and subscribe if you haven't already. I post every day except for Tuesday and Friday afternoon sometimes, and I'll see you in another video soon. Bye.